going down, y'all. Y'all now tuned in to uh, Ross Boxing. You know me, Rose Gold G. I mean on the motherfucker. Strawberry Banner. Bye. Show Banner. I mean, that's how you pronounce it, yeah. Motherfucking yoga. But at the end of the day, we're going to get into this Pacquiao and his Mayweather fight. Pacquiao going to get his ass beat. I don't know how many of you motherfuckers go think that that silly ass shit he be doing is going to work. He go rush in. He go swing. Floyd go tie him, slip the punch, crack his head. That's what's going to happen every single time. Soon as he pull out, he'll get cracked in his shit. Soon as he try to move to that left, to that right, Floyd going to be on his ass. Soon as he come in, he going to get popped. Unless Floyd want him to swing. Pacquiao ain't hitting on shit. That little motherfucker, Floyd fight. Motherfuckers just like come in the ring. They be like 165. You know what I'm saying? After the, the next day, Pacquiao ain't gonna come in no ring on 165. And Floyd keep them niggas that's 165 off his ass. You see what I'm saying? So what do you think he gonna do to a little motherfucker that's 100, 147, 150 pounds? He might come in 150 in the ring. Might come in 145 in the ring. But Pacquiao ain't gonna come in no motherfucker 165. Floyd gonna be moving that boy body. You see what he did to the Ricky Hatton monkey ass. Ricky Hatton thought it was sweet. Kept coming in, kept getting hit with that check hook. Cause the motherfuckers don't know how to slip them punches. They don't move their head. Pacquiao try that shit. Once Pacquiao get to thinking, he fucked up. Once you get to thinking, he fucked up. I'll be doing some more interviews on Ross Boxing about this motherfucking ass whooping Manny Pacquiao about to get. So y'all stay tuned.